There is, this is an inflection point, and we have NVIDIA reporting earnings, but the semiconductor giant signed a deal with the gaming icon Microsoft in a decade-long deal to bring Xbox PC games to NVIDIA's game streaming service. Kenny, are you excited to trade NVIDIA as they report earnings later tonight? Oh, yeah. I mean, I can't wait to see what this company comes uh, and has to say. But you know what I'm going to listen to? I'm listening to what Garrett tells us. The guy, uh, Garrett has nailed the Tesla and the, and the uh, NVIDIA short over the last three weeks to the day uh, using those. Uh, I, I keep forgetting the symbol, but the short NVIDIA. Uh, NVDS. Stock. Yeah. So amazing calls. You, you nailed the Tesla you nailed tw twice already. So I'm going to wait again. Listen, if they gap up we're in a, and we're still in that bearish environment, that's going to be a gap that gets sold off into. So tomorrow when they report, or tonight when they report, and we, re we reacted to tomorrow, that's going to move the whole market. And again, I mm -hmm. love that SOXL. SOXL has been coming in. You know, obviously we've sold off, you know, 20 points on the Qs, and no one's really seeming to really <laughs> talk about that as much as it, we, we've seen. We're right smack dab in the middle of this monster rally we've had off the low. So this is mm -hmm. it. I mean, it's, it's put up or shut up right now. So if NVIDIA gives it up, the, the queues are going to go down to where I think they're headed. We're going down another 10 points on the queues. So it's going to be a big day. I can't wait. Me too. Garrett, let's get, let's get back to you. Kenny, impressed by your trading in, uh, in the short NVIDIA stock. What are you going to be watching as they report earnings tonight? And what's your takeaway from this Microsoft deal? I think earnings are going to be down about 60% for Q4. Um, and probably a little higher than that, maybe even 65%. So... You know, there's a lot of chatter right now about this company. I think the only thing that matters to me, Vaz, is just the fact that it is the most one, one of the most overvalued stocks in the market, right? You got an 18.3 times sales, which is insane, 87 times earnings, which is insane. And this has been the, the number one correlated stock for uh, the S&P 500 negative momentum uh, over the last year. So we are now in a negative momentum cycle. And what that means is that if they sell, if they have a bad earnings report, and it's bad. And I'm, and I'm talking 2018 bad when that fell 19% in a day. I think that's entirely possible today. If, this is, if, they, if their guidance is bad, this market, at the way that this has rallied from 140 to 225, that has largely been retail chasing. Retail is going to dump in a panic. Now, they could surprise, and you maybe get back up to 220. I think there's a lot more downside. I typically would be shorting this right now, but we have earnings. Um, mm -hmm. we, we, just, we just had this negative event transpire, so earnings are a little goosed up. I'm looking for this to sell off, and then I'm looking to short this back down to right where we started. My price target on NVIDIA is 140. Wow. Over wow, 12 months. Great. That would be reverted back to the point of control here in NVIDIA. And, and when we have these major gap downs back into the volume profile, Garrett, that will help bring it even lower to its point of control or the value area low, depending on where price hits.